Yes, I'm actually outside. Uh, I'm outside, I have sunglasses on because the sun is right in my eyes. I don't know if it's showing up for you, but it is right in my eyes. So I have these on so I can at least read some of the questions off. But I'm going to be doing a QA. and a I might do more videos outside because it's just nice outside right now. It's like perfect time of year. Almost fall. I love fall. Okay, let's get into some of the questions. I'm doing, I was already doing stuff in my eyes, you can tell. Let's get into some of the questions. First question is, would you rather shove your toe, kick, or kick your toe, your big toe with a nail, right, in it, against walls as hard as you can, or stab yourself 123 times with a rusty spoon? I'd probably be stabbing myself with a rusty spoon. Yes, I know that hurt, but it seems like the best thing to do. Sorry about that. It seems like the best thing to do. I wouldn't want to kick my toe into a wall with a nail in it and get it shoved up in there. No, no. I can't even handle stubbing my toe. Would I rather be a boy gamer or a girl gamer? I'd be a male gamer. Male, female. I'm just gonna say male. Uh, I'd be a male gamer. Just because I'm a male. I'm not being sexist or anything. I'm, I'd just be a male gamer. Where do I want to be in 20 years? Either on a farm or something film wise. Or something in that sort of thing. Like pictures, photography, anything like that, or on a farm. Crystal asked, am I your friend and what's my favorite color? Yes, you are all my friends. If you're watching this, you're my friend. I need to take these off. Uh, if you're watching this, you're my friend. If you're a hater, then you're a hater. Oh, more power to you. Uh, and my favorite color is like lime greenish. Or green, plain green. My hair looks horrible. <laughs> Okay, this one is similar to the first question. It's, would you rather kick your big toe with a toothpick in it or cut your eye open with a razor blade? I'd do my toe. Unless there's nothing I can do for my eye then. If there's nothing I could do for my eye, then I'd cut my eye open because it's useless anyway, pretty much. I can't see out of it. Eat a mustard filled donut. That guy, he just wants to see me stuff. <laughs> what is your favorite thing about YouTube? My favorite thing about YouTube is probably just half the time the people. And then you get like stupid people that are like, if this is a comment on one of my videos. It's like, why are, the, are you telling my 12 year old or 8 year old or something son to go kill himself? And it wasn't even relevant to the video, so I have no idea. What is your favorite thing to do in your spare time? My favorite thing to do would probably be anything with my drone, photography, or this. I'm trying to do this more now. I did get rid of my vlog by accident. I accidentally deleted the wrong file, so that's why this is here, or else this wouldn't be here. This would be like in a week or so. What kind of... Wait. Okay. Yeah, what kind of editing software do you use? I use Sony Vegas, I think, Pro 12. So I just kicked my stand. Smart one. Hope I'm not messed up any, in any way, like how my angle is. No more drinks under my camera, so if I kick it now, <laughs> or if my phone falls, that'd suck. Keegan asks, would you want to do YouTube for the rest of your, for the rest of your life? I would do YouTube for the rest of my life if it, if it was an option, like, I'd have to be making something off it. I wouldn't be able to do it for my entire life, like, full time. I'm not even doing it full time right now. I wouldn't be able to do it for the rest of my life if I wasn't getting paid for it, because it'd be harder then. Like, oh, the sun's in my eyes again. Uh, it'd be harder to do that. Like, if you had no income and you had to actually work, work a job, like, full time, everyday job, It'd be hard to do YouTube, I think. My job is part-time, so I wouldn't know, but I think it'd be hard to do YouTube without an income for the rest of your life. And with how it is for a bunch of people now, as of, I think it was Friday, there's a car. But income, without income, YouTube's basically nothing. Like, to certain YouTubers that live off it, that, like, 
like Jacksepticeye, PewDiePie, those types of people, they need YouTube's income because they do the YouTube every single day. The YouTube, they do YouTube every single day, and that's where they get their money half the time is from their AdSense. But I don't think Jack, PewDiePie, Markiplier, and a whole bunch of other YouTubers that cuss or show any like just even cleavage you get demonetized for. And speaking of not being monetized, five of my videos are being demonetized and copyrighted because a copyrighted song, even though I download everything, it's from NCS, no copyright sounds. They didn't co they didn't file the complaint. I don't know who did it, it's just saying that I can't use it. But I think I'm getting, I think I got that figured out so far. I think I got most of that done and out of the way, because what I use this this background music you're listening to is no copyright. My shirt looks weird, like but it's just a bunch of stuff with YouTube that's being messed up right now. Like, I don't know. I don't like it. It's irritating me. And it's a good thing I don't cuss in my videos or, you know, just take my shirt off at random times. I can't do that because uh, partial nudity as the new agreement. But let's get on to the next question. I just got way off subject. I just checked, checked my Instagram and the next question was, what do you think about YouTube's new terms of service conditions. That was a brand new comment. Thank you, whoever asked that. You just got the whole answer before it was even ready. The next question is, will you ever call any of your fans? I don't have fans. I don't call them fans. And there's a few people that I know actually come back to my videos, like every day, every time I upload at least. But I wouldn't call them fans. I would call some, yeah. That'd be like a thing I'd do in the future. I'd get, I'd probably get like a prepaid phone and just call, or have people call off that and answer random phone calls if that ever work. Next question was, how was your day? My day has been pretty good so far. We're do, we're doing a party for my sister because her birthday is tomorrow. Her birthday is nine twelve. You might be seeing this on nine twelve, but it was pretty good so far. Next question is, what is your phone number? Okay, this next question. It's from someone that found me on live me. This is gonna turn into a rant, <laughs> sorry. But she goes around telling people her aunt got shot, stabbed, and died of cancer on live me so she'll get people to follow her. The bug just landed in my drink. But she'll go around doing that, saying like, oh, you should come check out my thing because my aunt got shot and died of cancer. And I've seen her in other ones. She has got stabbed and died of cancer. And then I've seen another one, she just got died of cancer. And then my friend's seen her in other ones. Like, she's got shot and died of cancer. She's doing it for publicity so she can get followers on Live Me. And she, I went to one of her things, like her Instagram pictures. I said something, and her best friend that she even has her, as her best friend said none of that ever happened. And it's people like that that irritate me on the thing. I don't know, I hate people like that. It's like, oh, it's like my mom just died, go follow me, and subscribe for respect. That kind of stuff, that irritates me to a whole nother level. Like, this is normally irritated. I'm up, up here. Since you guys can't see that, that's where I'm at. <laughs> but I think I'm going to leave this video here before it gets turned into a giant rant. I think, yeah. It was more of would you rather than a Q&A, but yeah. Uh, if you guys are new here, make sure to subscribe and like this video, and I'll see y'all later. Bye.